Hey everyone, so I thought I would do a quick comparison or set of comparison clips between the Chandler tube driver, the Ibanez TS9, and a Boss SD1. Um, and this is the Boss SD1 that I modified some time ago, but it still sounds close enough to the original that you can, you can tell what it is and uh, get the idea. Um, basically, we just want to just want to kind of a b them against a b the uh, the tube driver against sounds that we you know that we know that we've uh, heard before. Um, clean sound is the uh, it's a Fender Twin guitar is an Ibanez RGA one twenty one with a Andy Timmons uh, Demarzio AT one in the bridge. Here's the tube driver. So the gain is about as low as it'll go. Okay, we'll start at noon and um, we'll just kind of see how they all compare. Lot of people like to run the uh, tube screamer at minimum drive and maximum level also the same with the tube driver so we're going to turn the drive all the way down the level all the way up and i know that nothing will come through with the drive down tube driver because i've tried it before so we're going to turn it up till something comes through the way that legend has it that Stevie Ray Vaughan used to use his tube screamer.
did something similar to that with this one set about there. You kind of an idea of what the all of them are about specifically the tube driver it tends to be a little bit uh, has the ability to get lots of highs we turn the highs all the way up you can see that it's uh, both of them all the way off. I tend to kind of prefer that setting. Because of the tone stack and the tube driver, that with the bass and the treble all the way on zero is almost the same as having the uh, tube screamer with the tone at noon. All right. I hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for watching.